going on YouTube? It's your boy Lou back at it again with my team video. Today's video is on the top 10 shooting guards in the game under 50k. This is all my opinion so you guys can flip flop or like tell me who you think should have been on this list. This is just a list I made up like real quick that I thought by my personal experiences like running into them. How people like use them and all that. Right now I'm just pulling it up. The first At number 10 we got DeMar DeRozan. He's at 60k right now but he, he fluctuates between 50 and 60. That's why I just uh, put him in the in uh, at the 10 slot. But this is just a better, well a cheaper Tracy McGrady. Literally, this is the, the Dark Matter Tracy McGrady. He has the same animation, same everything. 93 perimeter D. Every, like, he's a good card. Excuse me. He has a crazy jump. Like, he has deep threes. He has every badge you need except blinders. Like, if you put blinders on this card, it's literally, the, it's literally T Mac. It's T Mac. Straight up. Bro, this card got, like, that Kobe, Trey Burke, like, little duo. Uh, how do I explain it? Like, it, they're shot. It, it's so easy to time. It's just a good card. That's just At number 9, we got Clay Thompson. The new Dark Matter that came out. I know a lot of people are going to disagree between, like, 5 and... I mean, 9 and 5. But this Clay Thompson... Like I said, it's personal preference at this rate... At this point in the season. Uh, He has a 99 three ball, 90 driving dunk, 92 ball handle, 98 steal, 98 perimeter, 93 interior D. So he can guard the center so uh, a little bit if he gets put into situations where uh, like they run a pick and roll and they have to switch every time. He's fast, he's got a 95 speed, he's 6'6", six, six, plays a 2 guard. Bro, this card's insane. His jump shot, dude, he's the best spot-up shooter in this game. The, him and Jeff Green. But I couldn't put Jeff Green in this video just because Jeff Green's a small forward. But man, I'm telling you, this card is butter. Like, his shot is just, uh, I don't know, man. He, his shot is just like a standing jump shot. Like, you can shoot it off the dribble and all that, but he's just a, a good... Like, if you got a good point guard and you dish it right to the corner or the top of the key or anything... It's going to be knocked down if you know his release. Like after At number 8, we got Obi Toppin. This card is... He's 6'9". What did I say? You can play him at the 1 if you really want to. But I, I would play him at the 2 because his jump shot a little iffy. Like, it's one of those little ugly jumpers. Like, I don't know how to explain it that much. But, he, he like, once you get like used to it, it's good. He has a 98 driving dunk, 93 pointer, 86 ball handle, 90 block, 87 perimeter D, 89 uh, interior D. He is a pink diamond. He's only like 5K, so he, but he's like still like top 10 shooting guard in the game, in my opinion. My opinion. Uh, 91 speed, 90 speed with ball. He can guard the one through four. He can't guard the five because he'll get smoked by like Bobo and him. But he has all the badges you need. He has deep threes. He has everything. At number seven, we have Denny. This is one of my personal favorites because he's on my team at point guard, but he is a good shooting guard. You can run him at the two. He's 6'9", 225, and he has a 93 three ball. His jump shot is cash. Like, it's one of those quick jumpers. You can just get it off, like, quick enough. Like, if, it, if somebody's running right at you, they jump no matter what. Dude, you'll get it off in time. Like, it's like Steph Curry, like, esque, like, uh, like, essence. Like, in real life, how Steph Curry literally just gets the shot up, like, mad quick. And, like, nobody can block it, even though they're, like, near it. But he has an 86 ball handle. He got the curry slide. He got all the like the normal stuff. He has like the pro three behind the back. Everything. 92 perimeter D. 82 interior D. Speed is a 94. Speed with balls 94. Uh, 94. Again, he has the same badges as Obi Toppin. Like he, he's good. He has he has deep threes. He has circus threes. He has all the shooting badges you need. All the playmaking ones you need. You got stop and go. You got bullet passers. You can dime people with this card. Yeah, like, y'all can stop the video. All he misses is, like, blinders or something like that if you really want to, like, abuse him. At number six, we have DeAndre Hunter. DeAndre Hunter is a, like, he's a budget Kawhi Leonard. No bull. Shiz. Um, he has a 96 three-pointer. 90 driving duck, 86 ball handle. His long wingspan helps him on the perimeter and interior because he has a long at wingspan. 96 perimeter D, 87 interior, 97 steel. You know how insane that is? 88 block, 95 speed, 90 speed with balls, a little bit on the slower side, but if you have him guarding the best player, like, he can guard, like, a Ben or something like that. He can guard him. He can't sh completely stop him, okay? Don't take the words out of my mouth. But he will slow him down. Straight up. He will slow him down. That That's at number six. He has every single, like, badge you need. He has literally deep threes. He has everything. Like I said, this is all personal, uh, personal preference. Kobe and the number four uh, can be like flip flop. This is number five, 
But Kobe is a 6'6", 205-pound. I had to put like Kobe, man. The mom in here, you know. 96 three-pointer, 95 driving dog, 88 ball handle, 90 steel, 95 perimeter, 80 interior, 95 speed, 94 speed with the ball. It's just Kobe, man. Like, you already know he's going to have the shooting badges, everything that you need for a shooter, except blinders, of course, because they don't like giving blinders to anybody. But this card is insane. Just for, and Especially, it's Kobe, man. It just literally is invincible with a little bit lesser stats and lesser badges. Same animation, same everything. Every dribble package, every shot, everything is the same. At number four, we have Cliff Robinson. Hear me out. The only reason I'm saying this, he says you can run 2-3 with him, and he's 6'10". He's a 6'10 shooting guard. Like, bro. 95 three-pointer, 95 driving dunk, 86 ball handle, 94 steal, 94 block, 97 in interior and perimeter defense, 90 rebounding. He can guard the 1 through 5 because he's technically a power forward in real life. Well, rest in peace because I think he uh, dies. So rest in peace. He has a 94 uh, speed, 92 speed with ball, 94 acceleration, 88 vert. Bro, he's 6'10 at the 2. At the 2. He has clamps. He has all the badges you need. Again, you need. He has deep threes. He has everything. It's the only reason I put him up here. And like the number three, and uh, after this list, everybody's better in my opinion. Just straight up, they're better. Three, we have Josh Smith. The only reason I have him above Cliff is because I like Josh Smith a lot more. His animations are a lot smoother for me. You can flip, or, uh, like you can uh, interchange them if you want. This is just my opinion. Again, I'm, I'm going to keep saying that just because I already know I'm going to get him like, oh, you're missing this dude, you're missing that dude, and all that. But he's got a 94 three-pointer with a shoe, of course, because this dude has a shoe, I think. I think he has a shoe on him. Let me, let me go to one that doesn't have a shoe. Okay. 91 mid-range, 91 three-pointer, 96 driving. Look, you already know he's going to catch body. You already know Josh Smith. Josh, especially Hawk Josh Smith. He was built different. 95 block, 95 steel, 95 perimeter, 93 interior, man. These cards can guard 1 through 4. And 1 through 5, some of them. Like, the next two are definitely 1 through 5. 94 speed, 94 speed with ball, 93 hustle. I don't know why I said that one, but yeah. He has all the badges. Once again, he has ankle breaker. He has all the badges you need, deep threes. Almost everybody in this charge is going to have deep threes and all the shooting badges you need, except for blinders. Blinders you're going to have to buy, because I know blinders is expensive for most people, but... Yeah, that's number three. At the number two spot, we have Yi Jingling. I believe that's how you say his name. I believe. He's a seven-foot shooting guard. Seven foot. Yeah, you heard me right. 93 three-pointer, 90 driving dunk, 88 ball handle. Like, he shouldn't be able to, like, dribble. He's seven foot tall, man. I don't even know how my career player can do that. 90 perimeter D, 90 interior D, 89 offensive uh, rebound, 92 defensive rebound, 91 speed, 90 f speed with ball. I had to bleep myself out. He's 250, so he can't curry slide. But he still has that little, like, clean behind the back, you know, that you l get a little bit of speed boost. You know what I'm talking about if you know how to, like, dribble with, like, actual players. He has deep threes, he has fade A's, he has all these good badges. I don't believe he has blinders, but let me check real quick. Now, he doesn't have blinders. He has every single badge that I was telling you guys about. And he's under 50k. Like, all these cards are under 50k, bro. And at the number one spot, we got Manupo. Uh, bro, what, what, what can I say? He's 7'7". Seven 200 pounds. He can't curry slide because he's, like, over the height limit, I believe. He has a 3-pointer, 93-pointer, 90 standing dunk. Of course, he's 7'7". Seven he can guard the 1 through 5. He has an 88, I mean, 85 driving dunk, 86 ball handle. 86 ball handle at 7'7". Seven, seven. 2K is on some sh this year, man. 98 block. That should have been a 99 in my opinion. 91 steel. 90 perimeter D. 94 interior D. 94 and 95. That should have been 99 offensive and defensive rebound because he's 7'7". Seven, seven. Who's going to out snag him? Come on, 2K. The only thing that it's a little bit weird, like, don't get me wrong. It says, it says he has an 83 ball, uh, 83 speed. He does not got an 83 speed. If you know NBA 2K Next Gen, every every center that is tall is faster than half the guards in the game. Manu Bull is faster than, like, De'Aaron Fox. Like, De'Aaron Fox. Like, you think about that. One of the fastest players in the league, Manu Bull, that's not even playing, that is, like, 30 times his height, 
is outrunning him. It's been tested by DBG. Shout out DBG. It, it, oh my god, he has Intimidator. He has everything. You already know. He has. He, this card comes with blinders. Let me make sure that he comes with blinders. He comes with blinders, bro. He comes with blinders. Deep threes. Set shooter. Oh my. This card is just. You, what can I say? The only thing he doesn't have Hall of Fame is his clamps that you really don't need that much because he's 7 7. You can literally run 2 3 and you just grab it. Like, just straight yank the ball out of people's hands. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's the list. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want to see any more, like, position, like, top 10s, under 50K. Like, let's say a, a center position, power forward, small forward, or point guard. If you want to see under 50K, I'll look them up, and I'll tell you which ones are the best ones. Yeah, be sure to follow all my social medias down below in the description. It's been your boy, Lou, and we out to stay. Peace.